I think he's lost. Okay, he found us. Oh, no, there he goes. Oh, I'm here, I'm here. Oh, there we go, backing in, backing in. Okay, let's go around and meet him. I'm so ready. Hi. Hi, how are you? Good, how are you? Good. What's in here? It's not a big spider, is it? No, it's two snakes. <laughs> <laughs> awesome, Yay. thank okay, you. Have a good day. You too. Thank you. First, I want to apologize because the camera guy slash cameraman Neil, my husband, he's not here right now to help me film, and he's the one that knows all the gadgets and gizmos, and so I do apologize if the lighting is off and whatnot. So um, here we are in our kitchen, and we're going to unbox. So I we ordered a um, female... Anery, which is the anatheristic version, which just means they lack red pigment. So they have like gray, black, silver, um, bluish colors. And so we got the female Anery Magdalena rosy boa and a male regular Magdalena, but het Anery. So he's capable of producing um, Anery. So he'll be visually He'll just look like a regular Magdalena, but he'll be able to produce his babies. They have a chance of being Anry, so they'll look visually different. So let's see. Oh my gosh. Oh, let's see what we got. So here is, oh, hi, sweet babies. Oh, look at them all curled up in there. The hi, sweet pea. Look at you. Oh, you're huge. So this has got to be the female. She's huge. Yes, so female Anri Magdalena. Oh, my gosh. Okay, so I don't know if you can see in the background. I have their tanks, but I do not have them. I have their heating going, but I don't have them set up yet because that's going to depend on what we find during their kind of like quick health check. We're going to check for mites and make sure they're breathing okay. And if all that comes up clear and they check out okay, then I will put aspen at the bottom for bedding because they like to burrow. If there is any issue, then we will switch and use paper towels as a substrate while we treat. And obviously if there's an issue, we'll get a hold of the breeder. We got them from a guy named Matthew from Florida. So hi Matthew, if you're watching. And thank you for your very beautiful babies. All right, little bit. Look at her, she's already looking. Hi baby girl. So the female is our Anri, our visual Anri. Oh, she is giant. Hi, baby. Oh. All right. Hi, sweet pea. Oh, my God, I can't believe how big she is. She's got to be bigger than our other female. Oh, she's beautiful. Okay, well, while you have your head stuck in there... Let's check all your parts. Make sure you don't have mites. Hi, baby. You wanna come out head first, Cece? Aw, oh, sweetie, here. Let's move your bag. Wee! She's loving her bag. <laughs> I know, baby girl. You had a long journey. Come on. Boop, boop, boop. Why is this so difficult? There we go. All right, so here's our baby girl. Oh, she looks gorgeous. Absolutely stunning. Hi, baby. She doesn't look like she's in blue or anything like that, but as you can see, she's got like the gray and black. It's almost more, it's actually more silver. It literally is like shining silver. Nice, yeah, sweet girl. Oh, I love her so much already. We'll have to think of a great name for her. I see no sign of mites. Check her belly. Oh, look at that freckly belly. Look at all the spots. Oh, <laughs> she's saying hi. What's that? Are you on camera? Okay, so I love her already. She's, oh God, she's so hefty. 
She's so hefty. All right, so I will place her back in her bag where she seems to be comfy. <laughs> Slide right in there. And then we're gonna check out the mail. And here's our mail. And the mail is clearly much smaller. They were, I was told that they were both six years old. So he is, oh, he's gorgeous too. So he's just your regular Magdalena. He's a little lighter in color. So the, well, he still has the black striping, but then the, whereas on the female, it was a silver stripes. He's more of like a, kind of like a grayish. There's not a huge difference in the two of them, but uh, there's definitely, he's definitely lighter. Come here, baby. Let's check. Oh gosh, those bellies. Look at the belly, the freckles. They love the camera. They're very into the camera. So yeah, so I am super happy. Thank you so much, Matt. I don't see, um, same here, I don't see any, oh, <laughs> he's crawling around the camera. I don't see any mites on him either, and he's completely tangled in the camera. Oh, he's very sweet. He's crawling, he's crawling over the camera, up on my shoulder. Here we go, buddy. And so, yeah, so, okay, so I am good. I am happy with them, definitely gonna keep them. They don't seem to have any breathing issues. There's no bubbles, no swollen throat, um, nothing like that. So yeah, I'm gonna say these two are keepers. So let's uh, get their tanks ready. We're gonna go ahead and do Aspen so they can burrow and be happy and warm. So I'll probably, I'm gonna get all their stuff out and ready and I'll set up one of the tanks. I'll put the female in here because it's pretty. Oh, hi, sweet girl. Oh, I can't, I just can't get over how big she is. She's so much bigger than our coastal female adult. What do you think, big mama? I know, so they came from a breeder which kept them in like the bins, the rack system. So she's probably like, what the heck is all this stuff? Aw, oh, sweet girl. You guys will have to comment with any names you can think of for these guys. God, that silver just shines. It almost looks like fish scales. <laughs> They're so shiny. I'm so happy with them. I'll have to keep you guys up to date on if they use the hammock or not. I'm super interested in finding that out. All right, so we'll just let them sit in these tanks for about 10 days, then we'll move their tanks from the kitchen into the reptile room. If you have any name ideas or tips or suggestions, let me know. And uh, especially the names, I have no, I'm so bad at names, <laughs> but I really want them to have good names because I love them so much and they're beautiful and they deserve to have good names. Um, but they're gonna be great additions to our family and the kids will be home after school and they'll see them. They don't know they're coming today, so that'll be a good surprise for them. And uh, like and subscribe if you wanna see anything new. And uh, I'm so sorry, I hate saying that, but the cameraman will be mad at me if I don't. <laughs> and we'll see you guys next time, bye.